Right, here we go, my first PlayStation Home video uh, in about three years. Um, as you can see by my outfit, there's a good reason for that. Um, I'm in a tweed jacket, bow tie, the Doctor's outfit basically, the 11th Doctor. Um, on PlayStation Home, they brought out the Doctor Who Wave 1 range, so um, you can buy the things in the pack differently. Uh, different. I'll say that again. You can buy the things in the pack separately. Uh, I think each outfit is about £2.50 uh, in the UK. Couldn't convert that to dollars for you if you're in America, so I apologise for that. Um, but yeah, £2.50 per outfit. Uh, there are about 12-ish things in there. Uh, two of the packages, uh, two of the items being packages, um, at least. So, yeah, I bought the full package. The full package came to £11.99. And I'm in Home Square at the minute, or at least this is what I think is Home Square. It didn't look like this last time I came on. There's Pottermore, uh, which I'll probably do a video of, because I've not been there. Casino, uh, and a load of different things. So, yeah, the TARDIS has landed in the middle of, in the middle of Home Square. So, um... Have a look inside. Uh, I did buy the PlayStation Home uh, apartment. What's going on here? Yeah, the PlayStation Home ap apartment for Doctor Who. So it's basically the last, the previous TARDIS. It's not the new one, not the silver one. It's the, it's the Amy Pond TARDIS. Uh, so Wave Two is coming soon. So I'm looking forward to seeing what's in that pack. As soon as I find out more, I'll put another video on. Now I can make PlayStation videos. Uh, I can enter the TARDIS or view the star. I will view the star. So I can show you what what things are here. Um, right, this is what I bought. The Wave 1 bundle. <coughs> uh, and that just includes the TARDIS. Uh, it includes a clubhouse as well. Uh, a cost the 11th Doctor costume. It includes a sonic screwdriver. Silent costume. River Song costume if you're female. River Song's PDA. A Silurian costume with the mask and everything. Uh, a Cybermat companion. A silent costume, if I haven't already covered that, I think I have. Uh, and you can see the image, it's not very clear, it's not even clear on my TV screen to be honest. Uh, but you see the Silurian, the silent, you get River Song costume. They've not made the characters look anything like the Doctor or River Song there, so. But yeah. BBC Active Camera and BBC Active Light. So whatever, whatever that is, I've got it for nine. Well, twelve pound. So yeah, you can see a, a close up of these. Uh, that's just the private space in the clubhouse you get for eight pound. Well, seven ninety nine. The Doctor's costume, River Song, PDA, Sonic Screwdriver, Silurian, Silent, and the Cybermat. So that's it. Exit the star. I just press square because I'm used to playing Xbox. And I think if I press enter the TARDIS, that will take me to my personal space. Not 100% though. So we'll see. We'll see where it takes us. Where's he taking me? Where's he taking me? Right. I've got a strange hairdo. Not that you can see it under this sombrero. Don't know if you've heard, but sombreros are cool. Right, so you come in. Um, one fault I do have is the back wall that you can see right in front of me, where the cameras usually are in the TV show. They haven't made it into the TARDIS. They've just put a, a wall across it. So either they've just been very lazy, or Wave 2 might include something that extends out to that side of the TARDIS as well. So, um, Right, a crater for no apparent reason. Oh, you can see under it. We've seen the Doctor under here a few times um, in specials and I think in a couple of episodes as well. So, not really a practical place to put your uh, furniture down, but still, looks pretty cool. There's a lot of videos going on, but they're only videos from Series 5, so two series ago now. Um, the detail on the, on the TARDIS is pretty good, though. Can't knock that. 
can't do much with it. You can't interact with it, which is a shame. It'd be nice to be able to press a few buttons and it'll light up, but... That's going up and down. They've got the noises off perfectly. They've got the screen there, which would be nice if it flicked through a different, few different images, but never mind. Oh, what's down here? I haven't been down here yet. And there's a lot of these tunnels going, well, obviously on the lower level and on the, well, on a higher level. Ah. This is very classic Doctor Who. I didn't come onto the lower level when I explored it last night. I just just checked up, uh, checked out the upper levels, but which seem to be full of glitches. I, I won't lie. As much as I like the apartment, um, there are a lot of glitchy things. I don't know if it's meant to be like that, but oh, what's this? This is odd. Perfect to make into a room, though. Oh yeah. I've been in here. And I haven't used the console for a while, so how do I redecorate? That's the one. Add. Let's let's just put a table, a uh, sofa down. I'm gonna put a table down, but never mind. Hideout sofa. It's a shame you can't actually get Doctor Who equipment. Okay, you can. There seem to be a lot of spawn points around. It's just flicking through different rooms we've got here. Oh, fair enough. But yeah, it's obviously going to place quite well down in that corner and around this area and the room to the side, so that's pretty cool. I like that. It's this room. It's like a wardrobe area. I hope you can get bunk beds because bunk beds are cool. I to really try and make my character look as much like Rory as possible. Because there are going to be a lot of Doctors and River Songs walking around, given that they've kicked away the costume. Going, hey, everybody can have it. I like it, though. It's more than Xbox have ever done for us. To be fair, I, I prefer my Xbox. Um, so it'd be nice if they did do something like PlayStation Home on there, but... We can only wait and see. Uh, right. More tunnels. Now I seem to just be walking through corridors up here rather than actually getting to any any spaces. But oh, it's yeah. I've, I came in this one. Not as not a very big space. You could probably put something in the middle. I don't know how I'd do this properly. Um, but yeah. Slightly disappointed with this area. This is bothering me. I just want to... I just want to put the um, sonic screwdriver in his hand. It's very slow to load. <coughs> there we go. A lot better. I mean, my character looks nothing like the Doctor apart from the costume, but never mind. Through here. This could be the glitchy room that I'm walking over to now. Yeah. Well, it looks like it to me. And the problem with this is, it's not actually a room. I don't know if it's meant to be like this, but there's no roof, there's no floor, there's no walls. Well, there is a floor because I'm not falling. But, and I just seem to be endlessly running and running and running and not getting anywhere. So, disappointed with this room. I hope they fix it, if it is an error. If not, I hope they put something in its place because it's a terrible idea for a room. Um, let's let's the place down. I think. I'm just turning my headset volume down there. That's why I'm walking like a drunk. It's through here. Oh, I know there's a cinema area somewhere. Oh, 
I didn't come through here. Ah, oh, this is a bigger space. Oh, it seems to be connecting. So you've got your blue lights, your red lights, your multicolored lights, your greeny colored lights, and your blue lights. Let's go through the purpley color. See what's through here. I know there is like a cinema area down one of them and it shows you well at least it started showing me the video of the um, the church, the Daleks uh, with Churchill uh, series 5 forgot what it called now Victory of the Daleks or something I don't know maybe a good guess yeah so you can sit in here put a bit of furniture I don't get why it's laid out like it is but you could probably put a few things down here, trees and whatnot, make it look half decent. I haven't designed my TARDIS yet. I probably will later on today. I might do another tour video. Uh, so have a look on the screen at the end of the video. I'll put a link to that uh, in the next video. Um, in the next video slot, obviously. It's, I can't put it up before I've made it. Um, and yeah. Oh, we're back here. So everything seems to bring you out into this circular room, and then round. But it's by far the biggest uh, apartment that I've ever done a tour on, um, and I'd like to have done some tours a while ago, uh, but couldn't because I couldn't record HD, but I've got a HD recorder now, so I can do a lot more tours of things on PlayStation. Uh, I was just limited to Xbox before, so... Um, I'll just change my character, I'll show a few different outfits that I can... I'll take this silly hat off. Because it's driving me insane. Right. I can maybe take him a bit more seriously now. Don't look anything like me. Uh, let's just change the hair to something a bit more Matt Smith while we're at it. Uh, not sure whether there will be. Oh, oh that's... There's got to be something more Matt Smith. Yeah, there. Oh. Come on. Load. That's one thing I find about PlayStation Home. It's just too slow to load. Uh, long spike. It now that's not my David Tennant. I would like to see in Wave 2 David Tennant's outfit. Uh, maybe an Amy Pond outfit. Uh, Rory outfit. Um, and see what it gives us with that. that that should put us on for a few outfits but they will probably put like a Cyberman in uh, possibly a Weeping Angel just because they seem to be a lot more popular here we go, we're waiting again Gotta be that, I think. Unless, go, no, it's not got a centre part in. It's not that. I think you can buy more, more hairstyles. I haven't done. Really should do if I'm going for something like this. Um, but yeah, I like how the hair colour hardly changes. Right, um, need to take his glasses off, maybe, or maybe have to invest in some uh, round glasses. That's their hats, right? Accessories, I reckon. Face, yeah. I haven't got any round glasses, so <coughs> have to give him a massive chin. But uh, you get the idea. That's the. 11th Doctor uh, outfit plus face as much as you can get it to look like the 11th Doctor uh, I can't really do much about showing River Song at the minute unless I can just change my character completely uh, The Silent which I think is pretty cool I'm, I'm surprised that they put that in Wave 1 I like that they have I, I like The Silent's probably my favourite monsters even though they've not shown up a lot but I think they're well designed and would like to see more of them, so that's the silent. Um, 
character gender right don't. she's just gonna have to be of a song I'm afraid because <laughs> I'm not messing about with her face again um clothing outfits River song, right? Wait for it to load. Um, so that you're good to go when you want to go on it. Anyway, River song. Um, yeah, I think that's quite accurate, really. Um, yeah, uh, I, I played the Eternity Clock on PC. Uh, they've obviously taken the Eternity Clock, uh, Eternity Clock outfit, and she's won it in a few episodes, but not all. Um, so that's the one that they've decided to go for, obviously. I, I better put a glove things on. Right, so I'll just wait for those to snap into place. Right, here we have River Song's gloves. All that weight, really, for nothing. All she's got is a PDA device. Um, yeah. Don't know why it took so long to download. And then we've got the Solaria, which, again, another. Well, it's a redesign this time that I'm quite fond of. Uh, like the Sontarans, um, I, I like how they've been redesigned. I like the uh, Cyberman read well, the the one that's coming up this series redesign. Um, yeah, it's definitely one I'm fond of. Oh, there seems to be a helicopter taking off above my house, so that's what that noise is. But yeah, um... Solarium. You haven't got any equipment with those, but... Yeah. I'm happy with the £12 that I spent. It's... I, I don't know if I'll use all of it. I probably won't. Well, I don't know. I'm, I'm half tempted to make my character a female character just so I can use the Solarium. I'm surprised you can't actually use the same character if you're a male because even though it is a female Silurian you should still be able to use it you can't see its face properly really you can't tell so anyway um sorry about the going on for 20 minutes uh i hope you liked the apartment tour i, I will do another apartment tour a quick run round when i've put some furniture in that place um i'll do i'll be bringing the pottermore um tour so that'll be interesting, I hope. I hope they've done a good job of the place. Uh, so make sure you click the links, have a look on my channel, subscribe to me and, and all that. Uh, we've done a bit of, well, not so much how-tos, but entertainment videos on GTA. Um, so check those out. I think the previous video uh, in the to the right of this, uh, you'll be able to click that and take, take you there. It's a, bit, it's a bit odd, but it should be. Should be good anyway, we enjoyed it. So yeah, thanks for watching and there should be another one coming very soon.